Welcome back to the channel guys. Now today we're going to be doing the A10 versus the MiG-21 SPSK. Now we did a dogfight like this in the past before so go check out that video. Also do not forget to put the subscribe button in the microwave with a metal fork. Also go in the comments down below and tell me what fights you guys would like to see in the future. Anyway let's get into the video. So the best tactic for the A10A is going to be its turn rate. It can hold a turn around 250 knots and it also carries the AIM-9Ls which are all as aspect and these do a number sometimes they don't work though so let's use our analytical spy network hacking data to see how this fight will end up so we're going to try to hold the circle as tight as possible and hopefully the mig will go out and bug out and eventually we'll be on his 6-2 splash hit. That, that's the hypothesis. That's what we're hoping to have. Now the MiG-21's best tactic is going to be its speed and energy. This thing is extremely faster than the A-10A and can outrun it, outclimb it, but it can't outturn it. And its delta wings might be a problem. But all that aside, it does carry the R-60s and countermeasures if you take off the gun. Yeah, this is going to be a pretty decent fight, speed versus maneuverability, and uh, we'll see who comes out on top. Also, one more thing, if you guys would like to join these versus battles, make sure to join the Discord down below to feature in one of these videos. Anyway, let's get into the duel. Here we go. He is going fast. So let's see what he does. It looks like he's going vertical. We could stay up here with him a little bit until we start bleeding. I'm not sure if he brought countermeasures, but... um. Since that thing has to swap out the gun for countermeasures and all that, I only brought two INLs just to balance things out a little bit. Looks like he's getting a solution here. And a jank. Come on. Get the gun on. Ah, oh, we just missed him. So we need to get the fight very, very close and low to the ground. We need to bleed him as much as possible. Um, but we're going to try that. Uh, no shot. That was very close. Alright, so it looks like he's very slow. Jank, let me set a shot there. I'm going to start using flaps. Let me get him a little slower. There we go. He ran right into them. That was, a, that was a tough one. So yeah, we need to get him very, very slow, and that takes a lot of baiting. So uh, yeah, this it does take a lot of baiting to get the MiG-21 slow, which is very dangerous. He's, he almost had me a, a couple times there, so... See how he does now. He's going vertical. We're gonna start baiting him a little bit. We'll get low too. Mines will start getting low now. If I were him, I would head towards the sun. But that wouldn't be fun now, would it? Didn't even look like it cracked. It turned a little, but. Okay, so. Gonna hold this turn here. Make him pull full AOA. Lead as much speed as possible on the MiG-21. And you can see when those lines appear, he's pulling very hard. So that's a good sign for us. All right. So it looks like he's he's uh gonna get out of that. We are on his six. Fox two. Where did that? Okay, all right, that, that AIM-9 just disappeared. Switch to guns here. Come on. Well, that hit his elevator off. Okay, now we're just, we're just very slow. Oh, this is not good for the big. This is really not good. This is definitely uh we'll just get close. Well, GG. Um 
That was not a fun- Oh crap, wait, we might get in his guns here, hold on. Okay, we're not. Okay, here we go, this is the third round. Let's see if the mink could turn this around. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, it takes a lot of baiting with the A-10. So, I mean, if you're able to get, like, if you have a chance to shoot the A-10, you better kill it, because it's gonna... In a prolonged fight, it's gonna be tough. Alright, so it looks like he's using altitude this time. I'll try to lay off the AIM-9Ls. They haven't been the best lately. Alright, so he's getting a solution here. We're gonna jank. Or just gonna full pull here. See what he does. Get some rudder input there. So he's sticking on me pretty well here. But uh, we'll see if, when he starts getting slow. I think he's already slow right now. But just to hold the turn here. And see what he does. And you can see he's bled a lot of his speed right now. He's going to start extending. He's pulling a lot of AOA. Okay, we're going to turn into him here. Like, I don't know. Gaiju needs to fix the AIM-9Ls because they're so funky right now. They work when they want to. All right, so we're we're very close to him. We're just hanging here, and uh, we'll see. Oh crap! We're very close to the ground. Track the air brakes there. Some landing flaps and there goes that rudder input a little bit he is very very slow you can see whenever the mig 21's got those lines on the wingtip you know it's pulling full a away or near it so that's a good sign to tell when uh your opponent's slow at least on the mig 21 okay so we are going 100 knots and the A-10 at low speeds handles pretty well. I, MiG-21, I can't say the same. Okay, so we ripped off an elevator. I think he's dead. Yep, there it is. GG. Well, that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to microwave the subscribe button and make sure to put a fork in there. And uh, yeah, this was a pretty good duel. Tell me what you guys think in the comments down below, what fights you guys would like to see in the future. And uh, Gaijin, please fix the AIM-9Ls. Other than that, join the Discord down below to feature in one of these videos. And take care, guys.